So what's the word, YouTube? You know what it is. It's your boy, Big Will. We're back with another episode of Life After Prison TV. This video right here, we're going to get into, right? Because you hear this, you hear this Gilligan talk all the time, right? And we're going to call him a Gilligan because that's what he is. That's how he acts, right? But Milk always calling someone a Gilligan. He's always talking. So Adam made a, Adam 22 from No Jump made a, Video saying that the China Mac and AD fight was fake, right? So then Milk jumped on the video. Milk made a reaction video and he said, I knew it. I told you it was fake. I told you. You knew it was fake. Uh, uh, AD had some like Halloween blood on his hands and stuff. But you see the way this clown goes back and forth, right? We're going to watch this video here. This whole video, all he talks about is, Oh, you know, you know it was real. China Mac, you can see his face was all hit and bubbled up. And and you can see that, you know. So he just runs with the narrative, right? And he's on China Mac shit. Now, I, don't know, I think China Mac's lame also, you know. Um, but milk, damn, he a lame, he a, he a clout chaser, he a wannabe, but let's just listen to him, let's just listen to him talk about how, oh, the fight was so real, and you can tell, and his face was all red, and his eye just bulged out, and then we're going to add the clip in, where he talk about, oh, you know it was fake. You know it was fake. I knew it was fake right off the rip. But let's listen to this one. West the deal, you told West the deal. Skip a little bit. Conspired and plotted to do a food vlog. And it didn't work out that way. He said, AD, you know, stop answering his texts, calling him, went in on him. So that was supposedly what the fight was. You all know China Mac was doing food blogs. I guess he talked to AD about doing a food a food video with him. And AD said he had talked about doing food videos a long time now. Um, but he ended up doing one without China Mac. And China Mac was butthurt. You stole my idea. You stole my... Man, they were doing food videos when China Mac was in jail still. You know, it ain't his idea. How many people make food videos? All over different platforms. But China Mac was hurt, but her, oh, I talked it over with AD and he took my idea, but that's what the whole, that's what the whole fight was supposed to be over, you know? No one's ever dropped a video of the fight. No one's ever dropped a clip of it. You, you, you seen, I don't know, what was it, a 30 second clip of AD holding up his knuckles. Yeah, you, <laughs> look at this. And China Mac, why are you even answering my phone? And my shit's nice, oh, and then China Mac made a couple of videos saying all he did was just grab me and wrestle me, threw me around, you know, but he didn't really connect with me if you did, you know, I got Asian skin, my skin would be busted up, and da-da-da, and the whole nine thing, you know. Neither of them have said that the fight was fake. Do I think it was fake? I don't care. I really don't care. That's their business. If that's what they're doing for reviews and they're getting them, so be it, right? Why does Milk care so much? You know, Milk's this... He talks about everybody, right? He talk about Crip Mac. He talk about Adam-22. But when Adam-22 had him up on No Jumper to get them views and make him somewhat internet famous, right? He was good with it. But then shit must have happened, and he might he might have wanted shit from Adam. Or who who knows? Who knows? He, you know, he's always got his own story, you know. Um, but then he was showing up to no jumper one day to fight Adam, and AD come out of the back and told him, I'm "Not here, dude. You know, <laughs> I'm like security. You know, <laughs> you know, not to come by here. Milk and stop that shit. You know, and nothing ever happened. Milk walked away, but." You know, so Milk would want to try and threaten someone like Adam because he's not a gang member or he's not a fighter, right? He's a BMX rider. 
But then they had somebody that was mediating when China Mac and AD was supposed to be fighting, right? So did they fight? Who knows? I, I, I really don't care. You know, but my, my, my thing is this clown, we're going to see in this video how he says, oh, the fight was real. You can tell. And then as soon as someone says it was fake, I told you it was fake. You can tell it was fake. AD had fake blood, that Halloween blood on his hands. And, you know, in this video, he's saying, oh, what did he do? Scrape his knuckles on the, you know, on the, on the cement before they took a video? I don't know. You, you got to make up your mind, my guy. Did they fight or didn't they fight? Was it staged or wasn't it staged? Over here, when it first happened, you're saying it's real. Then you make a video after, because you forgot about this one, because you always toast it out of your head, right? You forgot about this video, and you said, I knew it. I said it for a long time that they were fake. Now watch. Just let's watch them. And um, he said, AD, hey, stop answering him or whatever the case was, and some stuff transpired, but it's a video of the aftermath, so let's go. We're going to react to it, love. Come on. He's a weirdo. Hey, good now? Yeah, I'm good. Oh, shit, squash? Yeah. No, you should stop it. Come on, man. Introduce it to both of motherfuckers. You guys over here on the internet fucking arguing, fighting. You want one on one? Just squash it right now, honey. Alright, bro, that's it, Joe. That's it. That was a misunderstanding behind that shit. Because he got all his people hitting me up, all your people hitting me up. Come on, man. You guys are both my boys. No, no more, man. Come on. Honestly. That's it, man. Look at this shit. <laughs> Now, if it was real, that's a diss, right? That's a diss from AZ, AD, I'm sorry. That's a diss from AD. Oh, look at this shit. <laughs> look what I did. <laughs> that's from punching you upside your head, right? Like, like if if it's if it was real and it was squashed after they just fought, that's a diss right there. You don't do that, my guy. You're like antagonizing. Ha, 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 look it. Nothing wrong with me except for my knuckles when I busted you upside your head, you know? That's my opinion. Okay, so we ain't getting a full video of the actual, like, fight. But from this clip right here, I'm pretty sure y'all can see it. And it's really clear who won. Who won the altercation, son? Like, who won? AD, you know, he paraded around like a proud chap. Showing his knuckles. And then you got China Max standing around. Knees look like they about to buckle. Looking like a sad, ancient, extinct fish emoji. <laughs> yeah, this is crazy. But, um, yeah, they put... He got some of the corniest... What do you want to call them? Catchphrases? When he tries to rack on people? But, that, but um... It's not AD fought really. I mean, it's but not his fault that it transpired and it went this far. And this is where it went. It's not, but to be continued, let's go. Right All you gotta do is take up your phone call, man. Uh, you ignore my shit. Why you, ain't, why you ain't answering my shit, though, man? Nigga, you changed your fucking number, bro. I told you. That part was suspicious. When China Max says, Why you didn't answer your shit? And AD says, nigga, you change your phone number. That's not what China Max said. He didn't say, why didn't you call me? He said, why didn't you answer your phone? I was calling you. And AD say, man, you change your shit. Then, later on, when AD was talking about the fight, he did a couple of interviews on No Jumper and whatnot. Then he goes in and says he, he knew he caught himself, right? So th that part makes me think that it was fake, right? Because then he goes in and he says, I changed my number. You know, people were calling my old phone because I put my number out on, on live stream one time. And so many people were calling and, and spamming my number and stuff. So, so, so I changed my number. China Mac didn't have my number. But over here, he lost track of the skit. And he said to China Mac... Man, you changed your number. That part, I think, made it look to where it's really fake. Told you that. Ain't nobody still doing what I can't. He doesn't even pick up my phone call, though. 
Yeah. I told a nigga I ain't. It's not even about a fucking phone call, you know what I'm saying? I know how it feels when someone trying, you know what I'm saying? But that's that's not even. Besides, you, you point know me, you. I would never steal nothing. No, you know that. Miscommunication again. Yeah, just like that. Like, you know do do like the fucking one on one, girl. The situation is this. The whole situation. If 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 numbers or whatever, it feels like a miscommunication. The whole thing is that China Mac went on YouTube and uploaded a video like a rant, basically, like going in like AD from No Jumper. 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 I thought it was like a, a Gator Mac video. I didn't know what was going on. I was kind of lost. I'm like, damn. It's taking me like 7.4 seconds to address what he's talking about. Like he was going in on the video. Like, yeah, he took my idea. He's a clown. Like, I sat there and we discussed him. Well, we supposed to do it together. He's a clown. Like, I don't care about him or No Jumper. F them and all this type of stuff like that. So, um, I mean, he really put the plate in the motion. And, and, and the whole thing is, is it don't matter if AD made a food video, right? Like, China Mac had made several food videos in the past. So what if AD made one? So what? Maybe AD liked your idea. You know, people have ideas about car videos and, 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 and dancing videos. And uh, Does it mean that someone's stealing your idea? My guy, there's almost 8 billion people in this earth. Okay? Fact is, you're going to have the same idea as someone else. I'm going to have the same idea as somebody else. It don't mean they're stealing my idea. There's no ideas that are original, trust me. You know, and, and if you come across one, chances are out of the 8 billion people in the world, someone else has started the same thing, you know? And, um, you real lucky that this is the, uh, real outcome, like, this is the aftermath, but, you know, it's still respect to both of them for doing this, but I'm just saying, like, they sitting here, well, he's sitting here and trying to just play, like, oh, this is phone call. What about China Mac, like, going in on that video? That's what started it, him going in, saying, you clown, or just going in. You know, if y'all didn't see that, go do the reaction that I did. But I'm pretty sure most of y'all did. Come on. We're on the internet going back and forth and shit, you know what I mean? I got 10 people hitting me up over him, 10 people hitting me up over you. Come on, man, just watch that shit. And no, no, it's done. done. You already know you my nigga. It's done. It's done. Like I said, this is music communication. How about both of you guys have to go party, man? That's a fucking you right. bigger back and forth and shit. Come on, you good, right. You good, man? I'm good. Yeah, you good. You good, man? You good? Come on, man. You already know. Good. We don't play. China Mac I mean, they, they, you know, they, people were saying like, oh, ain't nothing really wrong with them. This was fake or it's not real. Something like that. And you still got people saying that after they seen this video. It is real. You could tell, like, China Mac little cheekbones is a little red. You know, it's like poking out his little lip or whatever. And AD hands is like, you know, how he gonna do that? What he gonna just go over there and act like he on Sherm and punch the concrete? Like, oh, let me fake a fight. Let me just hit the concrete. Like, boom, boom, or something like that. No, nah, ain't nobody doing that. This really happened. But, um, I don't know. They, they didn't post the video. You know, they didn't upload it. But we... You know, so 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 I'm not gonna keep going into the the the, the whole video. It's I don't know, seventeen minutes long or something. You know, this this video will be super long, but I just wanted just to hear him because we're gonna add the other video with it to show him saying, "I knew it was fake. I knew it was fake." You know, so so the. This is the clown that he is. He's the clown. He he, he gonna run with whatever narrative he think is getting the most views, and that's his thing. That's his that's his clout. Um, you know, China Mac is was making content with Crip Mac before he went to, to went back to jail. Milk's all over it. That's all he does is he he dogs China Mac now. He tried dogging Crip Mac for a long time. Oh, Gator Mac did. Gator Mac dad. Gator Mac and his dad. You know, Gator Mac did. It didn't get him nowhere. So he had to focus his attention on China Mac, you know? He don't go in on AD and stuff. He don't go in on the real gangbangers. He went in on Terrell a little bit. T-Rell or Terrell, whatever the fuck. 
he went in on him a little bit, you know, on T. Rell, and, and it might have got squashed because that shit ended quick, you know. But Milk supposedly one of them gang members. He's a he's a supposed Hoover. I don't know. I've never seen him with any other gang brothers, or he's never. No one's ever really confirmed it but him when he was on No Jumper. Talking about how he grew up black and he was adopted by a black family. And, you know, so all his relatives were black and he lived in the hood his whole life and blah, blah, blah. So, you know, he don't consider himself white. He considers himself black. He thinks he's really black, you know. But um, we're going to add the other video one. But let me know what you just think about this guy. Uh, every time he comes on video, it's... North, South, East, what's the deal, YouTube? What's the deal? You know the deal. Let's get 7.4 seconds to get your mind right. That's a GD. That's a GD code or some some stuff. I don't know. I don't I don't get into the gang lingo. You know, when I was in prison, I tried listening to it, and you'd hear the different gang members, and you see it writing on the walls and stuff like that, and I never get into the gangs. You know, um, I didn't need it. I didn't need gangs. I didn't need protection. Um... I stood on my own, you know, six feet, 250 pounds, I'm a mean machine, <laughs> you know, but this guy's, I don't know, 5'10", 140 pounds, he might have needed some, some gang protection, you know, but, um, let me know what you think about this guy, I don't know, I think he's, I think he's burnt, but we're gonna add the other video in, so you can hear the clip, and we'll take it from there. It's your boy Big Will Life after Prison TV. We'll see you on the next one. Let's check out the next clip. Peace.